On this channel, I'll be talking about whatever I fucking want, and uh, today I just want to rant about something different, because it's almost the end of March, and, you know, I just don't fucking get it as to why this has to occur every year. Why does March Madness start? At 10 or 11 days in later in the month of March. Why? Just why? Is there a reason that March Madness has to start every 10, 11 days a, a year? every March. Why can't March Madness start at the beginning of the month of March? Wouldn't that make absolute sense that March Madness starts on March 1st instead of like, let's say, last year, March 10th, or this year, March 11th, or next year, March 12th, like, wouldn't you think that it would be more sensible that March Madness should have started at the beginning of the month instead of 10, 11 days later? Like, why do they need to start March Madness a couple days late for? And if your answer fucking is that, oh, they start March Madness 10, 11, 10 or 11 days early, later, because All these college basketball teams have to go and prepare to get ready within the month of March. And if your answer is that, then well, that shit doesn't make any sense regardless. And if your answer also is, oh, it's because TV networks like TVS, TNT, CBS, and True TV need to prepare their broadcasts with a little bit more time. If your answer is that, then I am telling you, I am fucking telling you, this cannot be an excuse anymore. It's just weird that March Madness has to start a few days a few days late. Which almost takes up takes up like the entire month of March. Like, really, why wait this long? Why? Just, why do that? Why not just start at the beginning immediately on the first day of the month? And that's the one thing I don't get about March Madness. I 
I don't know why it has become a tradition every year to start at every 10 or 11 days later to start the game. Just start the game already. Just start now. Why wait a little bit longer? You're just gonna let half of the month go by already. And today is already like Wednesday, March 29th. And why the fuck does April have to do with March? What's the point of March Madness? What is the fucking point of March Madness? What's the point of it? Is the point of March Madness to be April Madness? Because I don't see how logical that is to broadcast all of the NCAA or the NCAA March Madness games in the month of April. I mean, seriously, why wait until sometime this April to immediately, like, stop broadcasting all March, March Madness games now? Why is there a need to wait a few days and then later on comes April? And then boom. March Madness continues on throughout the next month. Instead of calling it March Madness, in my opinion, don't you think it should have been called the NCAA Madness? Because if you're gonna like start. America's long time traditional basketball competition that are for college students. Don't you think that the final four should have been played? At least at least on like the last days of the month of March like for example today on Wednesday March 29th or how about Tuesday, March 28th. Monday, March 27th. Why, like, why not play those games after Sunday, March 26th? Why wait until Saturday, April 1st to then go to the Final Four? And then to go to the NCAA Tournament Championship. Why?
why wait this long? Why not play until the 31st of March? From the NCAA March Madness Final Four to the NCAA March Madness Championship on the 31st of March. Don't you think it actually really make sense to only play March Madness in March instead of April because playing playing March Madness until through the through the month of April doesn't make sense to me it really doesn't I don't know whose strategy was that in the first place back in like 83 years ago or somewhere around, around there but that person needs to like rethink their plans at least and try to you know, figure out what makes sense. Why is it called March Madness for a reason? Try to think about that. Really think about it long and hard. And see where that takes you because There's just no fucking way that that March Madness is normal to play in the month of April rather than at the end of March. I think whoever decided to start March Madness 10 or 11 days later into the month of March should also rethink the way uh, they start, you know, preparing for March Madness. Because I think March Madness, in my opinion, should begin at the beginning of the month of March and should end at the month of March. That's why it's called March Madness for a reason. And people who have never heard of March Madness before, they might be confused as to why March Madness games are being played in the month of April. And they probably still don't get to stay either if they have like watched it for, for for like the first time in their lives or if they have ever watched it for the first time in their lives back in like five years ago or ten years ago and still don't get it today like i've been watching march madness for the first time back in like 2016, 2017, and I, I really still don't get it. I still don't get to this day as to why March Madness has to be played throughout the month of April. Can you just play March Madness from the beginning of the month? Exactly on March 1st and then to the end of the end of the month on exactly March 
31st. Like, seriously, why not do that instead of having the Final Four and the NCAA Championship in April? I hope you think about this because, you know, that's more of a logical solution that I think would be, would be much more perfect. Because it actually makes sense to have these teams play March Madness only on the month of March, not April. 